If you are a beginner, be very careful with mushrooms like this, with white gills and a bulbous base, because some of the deadliest mushrooms in the UK, like the Death Cap and the Destroying Angel, have white gills and a bulbous base. Now this mushroom is called the blusher. It's in the Amanita genus, which is the same genus as those mushrooms I've just mentioned, like the death cap and the destroying angel. And even the blusher is toxic raw. However, if you cook it, it actually destroys the toxins. And so this is an edible mushroom as long as it is cooked. Now, although the death cap and the destroying angel both have white gills and a bulbous base, in reality, they don't really look like this mushroom that I've just shown you, the blusher. However, there is another mushroom in the Amanita genus, which does look very similar that is highly toxic called the panther cap so just to be clear this is the blusher but the panther cap does have white gills and a bulbous base because it's in the amanita genus it even has a similar colored cap and it also even has similar colored whitish gray scales on the cap as well so the key difference that you're looking for to distinguish between the blusher and the panther cap the easiest differences is first of all the fact that the blusher this one that is safe to eat as long as you cook it well it blushes red that's why it's called the blusher it has this pink reddish markings on it which comes with age or when, it, when it's damaged or bruised or cut whereas the panther cap does not bruise red or pink another key distinction which is always good to see as well for that extra bit of reassurance is that the skirt which is that bit just below the cap on the blusher this one here you can see it has striations on the top of the skirt whereas on the panther cap that also has a skirt but the top of the skirt on the panther cap is smooth it does not have striations on the panther cap whereas you can see the skirt here on the blusher has very clear striations